Kate Middleton is stepping out in style. The royal made her first official public appearance since Platinum Jubilee weekend, and she did so with her typical stunning fashion. The 40-year-old visited Little Village's Brent Hub in London on Wednesday, where she met with members of the organization and helped choose clothes and equipment for a family present during her appearance, according to a press release. The Duchess really took time to talk our staff and volunteers, who all said how down-to-earth she was and how engaged and interested she was in the work of Little Village. This boost from the Duchess will help to shine a light on the work of Baby Banks and will hopefully lead to increased support for their much-needed work, Little Village CEO Sophie Livingston said in part in a statement. The Duchess of Cambridge looked fierce in a white blazer and matching top, black trousers and a white clutch. She accessorized with chic jewel earrings and classic makeup paired with long, flowing tresses. The update comes after Kate and Prince William stepped out multiple times over the weekend to celebrate Queen Elizabeth's Platinum Jubilee, marking her historic 70 years on the British throne. They stepped out on Sunday on Buckingham Palace's balcony with their three children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis as well as William's dad, Prince Charles, and Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, and the Queen during the Platinum Jubilee pageant. Access Hollywood previously spoke with DailyMail.com's Charlie Langston about how the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge have been stepping things up in order to one day be the head of the monarchy. Kate and William are really kind of stepping up to the plate as far as leading the monarchy. Now, William is not the next in line to the throne. His father, Prince Charles, is going to be the next monarch in the United Kingdom. However, William and Kate are very much already in that kind of waiting in the wings role where they are both very much aware that they will be on the throne probably, you know, not too far in the future. I think they both know that Prince Charles is not a young spring chicken. He's not the age that Elizabeth was when she became queen. And I don't think anyone is expecting Prince Charles to sit on the throne for decades and decades to come. He will absolutely take on the role because he has been waiting his entire life to become king. But I think that his reign in comparison with the queens will be very short lived. William and Kate are already not acting as though they are already the leaders of the monarchy, but they are taking on a huge amount of responsibility, not just in terms of public engagements, but also in terms of the way in which the monarchy is run. They're making small but very important changes, opening up the monarchy to a more modern point of view, not perhaps in a way that is noticeable every single day, but bit by bit, they have kind of helped the monarchy to evolve, to kind of embrace new traditions, and to kind of maintain the important heritage of the past, while also kind of saying, okay, a few of the things that we used to do are seen as being very stuffy. They are very stuffy. Here are ways where we can kind of maintain the tradition behind these things, without making it appear as though we are completely ignorant to what the rest of the world is doing and how they're living.